guys, what's going on? It's Ryan Oder's Oklahoma Restaurant. Welcome to uh, Taste of Mexico. This show is kind of more dedicated to my guys because I want to make sure that you take care of your ladies out there. Valentine's Day, February 14th is coming up very quickly, but I got a special gift that you can get your lady after you have dinner here at Zocalo, and that is a chocolate truffle. We have a couple here, very cool. I'm gonna show you how to make those. Uh, we went uh, a little south of the border on them and uh, put a little infused chili in them. So let's go see how we make those. All right, so what we have here is uh, two cups of cream, heavy cream. Do not go light on this, guys. You have to use the heavy cream here. And it's super simple measurements. I got two cups of cream, and then we're gonna add this to two cups of chocolate, so two and two. On the uh, pot right next to the side, this is where we're gonna get our flavor. Now we're gonna try to go a little Mexican on this, so a cup of agave nectar, a cup of orange juice, and then I toasted some japones chiles. See how they got that nice black color in there. Once you taste this thing, you're gonna taste sweet, and then right at the back end, you're gonna taste that nice spice. Here, I want this to reduce down, so all the juice and the agave nectar, we're getting all that liquid out of it, and we want it to reduce down to a nice syrup, and that's really gonna infuse that chili in. So the cream's talking to us already, it's ready to go into the milk chocolate. So let's bring it over here. I'm gonna add this little by little. Now again, the chocolate is cold, and we're really just gonna try to bring both of these to the same temperature. But as we continue to mix, uh, it's all going to come together and be a nice consistency that we're looking for. Five teaspoons of the syrup, and then let's mix this. So what we're going to do is put it on the table, make sure it doesn't run on us too much. And with an offset spatula, any kind of spatula you can have at the house, we're just going to start moving this on the cold surface of the table. So the table is going to start stiffening the chocolate up to get it to the texture that we're looking for. Just finished tabling this thing up and I let it sit for about an hour to really firm up. I'm just going to roll these in balls. I'm just going to put a nice shine to it. Right on the top, make it look kind of cool. Here I got the uh, powdered sugar. And one last one here. What a great gift for Valentine's to show someone that you really care about them and we're thinking about them. Whenever you can do something by yourself, it's not the gift that was given, it's just the simple fact that you were thinking of somebody. And this is our way for Zocalo to say that we we're thinking about you. This is our last little shot here. I'm gonna close these things up, make sure they look nice fiance back at home. Hey, uh, Joe Anthony has a special treat for you at the bar. Remember to make your reservations for us. Uh, we're booking up super fast. We have music, live entertainment. The restaurant looks so beautiful with all the different candles and, and uh, design that we got going on. Four course meal. Come check us out on uh, February 14th for Valentine's Day. Thanks guys and have a good one. Hello, my name is Joe Anthony Savala, bar manager here at Zogola Restaurant. Welcome to our bar. So it's Valentine's Day and there is a drink that I'd like to make for my sweetheart. It's called the Sacred Heart. Uh, it's made famous by Johnny Raglan and Jeff Hollinger at the Absinthe Brasserie and Bar in San Francisco. One of my favorite water bowls. Let's get started on the drink. So we have the pomegranate flavored tequila called La Pinta, um, the absinthe and some limoncello. We're gonna add a little bit of lemon juice. We're gonna make a fabulous cocktail. You can't go wrong for Valentine's Day. So, let's start with an ounce and a half of the La Pinta. It has a nice little red color. The pomegranates are picked in Michoacan, Mexico and added to the tequila, infused with the tequila. So there we go, ounce and a half. We have Absello Absinthe from Spain. It's a great absinthe if you haven't tried it. Here we go, three quarter ounce of absinthe, the Green Fairy. And then we have a little bit of an Italian liqueur called limoncello. So there we go, half an ounce of limoncello. Here's the key, we're gonna add a quarter ounce of fresh squeezed lemon juice. So there it is, we just need one half of lemon. Perfect. So let's shake this cocktail up. I like to serve this drink straight up. You can obviously serve it on the rocks if you'd like. I just think it's a really, really sexy drink. Serve straight up. There we go. 
and I'm going to grab my channeling knife with a nice piece of lemon here and I'm going to actually garnish it right over the top here. I'm going to run it around there a little bit, do a nice little twist. And here we have the Sacred Heart here at Zocalo for Valentine's Day. Cheers.